Jingle bells, Batman smelt, Robin laid an egg. The Batmobile lost the wheel. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of The Cooperation. We're back to talking about CHOCOLATE! <laughs> I know, that's, that's the episode from- Chocolate? No, uh, good morning, sir. Can we interest you in some chocolate? Chocolate? Did you say chocolate? Yes, sir, with or without nuts. Chocolate? Chocolate? I can't. <laughs> CHOCOLATE! CHOCOLATE! It's more like that. My throat already fucking hurts. <laughs> if I didn't- it would I'VE BEEN CHASING YOU ALL DAY! AND- Oh, my oh I remember the fucking YouTube, like, parody of it. It's like, I've been trying to fuck you boys all day! <laughs> now that I've got you right where I want you! And, and then it cuts out to censored and he's like, <laughs> YES! FINALLY! <laughs> God, that hurts. <laughs> well, you're a trooper for doing the whole thing, so thank you. <laughs> oh god, I gotta do more vocal exercises. Yeah, we don't do any like exercises or like warm-ups at all whatsoever before. That reminds me, um in a zombie apocalypse, guns are good, but make sure you Grab a katana. Well, like a machete or a katana, something that that's that, so. Because bullets are good, but they did it on the MythBusters. It's good when it's you and just a few, and they're yeah, it's good and all, <laughs> and they're away from you and they're not surrounding you. But when you're surrounded, melee weapons ten times better in a situation like that. Well, yeah, you're swinging like crazy instead of, um, oh, he flew up like a balloon. And a katana is a long range sword. Yes, but not too many people are actually aware of how to use a katana. Uh, it's two handed. Two handed. Yeah, a lot of people don't know how to hold a katana or anything like that, or even a sword in that matter. But there's a lot of swords. You can out actually there. get very. Saber, you could get special. Play more katanas. You can get special made katanas that are. That are the type of swords that you would see in a cartoon, like if someone were to gently drop a leaf on it, it would cut the leaf. Well, that's just that's just how sharp it is. Oh, yeah, shit. they, they the, even the have oh, okay, they even good. have uh, diamond tipped katanas, but those are expensive as fuck. Oh yeah, they, those are collectibles. Those aren't even like don't you even... can you can use them. They're very good. They're sharper than normal ones. Anyway. So we're talking about uh, that episode with the chocolate. There was also in that Chocolates. episode- Chocolates! <laughs> there was the dried up sperm lady, which was- She looks like a brown, dried up sperm! Burnt, burnt. Brown, burnt, dried up sperm. Yeah. What? What, what are they saying? <laughs> what are they saying? <laughs> they say you buy some chocolates! What? What are they saying? They're chocolates! Chocolates! Yes, chocolates! Chocolates. I remember chocolates. Sweet, sweet chocolates. I always hated it! <laughs> what? I said I always hated it. I don't remember her actually saying I don't say, remember saying she it like said, that. Uh, she didn't say it like that. <laughs> what did she say then? She was like, I always hated it! <laughs> well, these chocolate makes you, makes you, was it younger or something like it's that? It's like, these chocolates aren't for eating. They, uh, you rub it on your skin and it makes it's you true. live forever. <laughs> and she said, live forever, and you the, say? And the daughter's like, no, no, no! Come on, start rubbing me with that chocolate! <laughs> she was naked, technically. She actually was. Because, I mean, there was no clothes on her. She was basically a birth of sperm. What was she actually in real life? Like, that's what she looked like, but obviously she's supposed to be a sea creature. What sea creature looks like a dry, like a dried up sperm? Squidward's left nut? I was gonna say a barnacle or something like that, but I don't even know anymore. Well, to be fair, she was the mother of that thing. But then again, Mr. Krebs is the father of a whale, but I think they explained that. Uh, I think they said she's adopted. Right? I don't know. There was a story for it, though. I, I know that much. Fucking Spongebob is weird, but you know what? It's still fucking funny. Like, I like the the older episodes, and I'm not too sure about the yeah, newer ones. Yeah, everything from the, the first movie and before it was phenomenal. The, then the second movie, changed. The second movie was okay, but it was just like, I don't know, we, we, we saw it in what theaters. What the fuck are they? They're like, yeah, the fuck Look at their necks! <laughs> <laughs> their necks are doing a 180! It's like, it's like their necks are completely broken. Uh, anyway, um... What the fuck?! I that's mean, not silly, that's traumatizing! That's silly, though. Nah. <laughs> 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 
But yeah, we <laughs> saw the movie, in th the second movie in theaters, and I don't know, like, you weren't really, like, I, I enjoyed it, but not as much as the first one, and you were kind of, like, hit or miss with it. You know, I just thought of something. With it's good and everything! <clears throat> with these guys going up, when you kill them, what if they're like, oh, at least they're going to heaven, and God is like, fuck you, and you just see the body fly down at top speed and leave a crater. <laughs> Uh, 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 who do we have here? Oh, fuck no, shoom! <laughs> we do a lot of god jokes like that. I don't know why. Ah, oh, shit. We love you, Jesus. Great. Well, I love you. Yeah, you I, don't, he, I don't know about him. He was Jesus for Halloween. Yeah. I mean, it was good and all. What the fuck? <laughs> we really gotta stop that. It's getting a little, like... It's getting a little ridiculous. <clears throat> How's that can of soda? Oh, okay, I, I, got all, I got all the hostages out of there. That's the first fucking time. Wow. It's a uh, big number. 100%. Is this one like 100%? Bam! Level 12. Office 13. Was that Office 13? Clearance 3, I think. I'm not sure. Stop tattle on me, tattle telling on me, you bastard. You know, anyway. I'm not gonna lie. My voice is shot, and I don't know how much of this fucking game I can take. I'm not playing it. But do you want to play it? No, there's 19 levels. Give me the fucking control. <laughs> okay. There we go. This is this is fun for me. What the fuck are you doing? Try not to get killed. Uh, well, like you know, you could still die from like not finding the fucking bomb. I'm just letting you know that right now. Okay. So now just uh, story time. Oh yeah, go on. You could you could shoot those. Well, when when that I wall. when I. Eat this. Whoops. You can shoot that wall, by the way. Well, the wall goes back there. So, when I was younger... Did I tell you how I discovered how to masturbate? <laughs> I don't think you actually ever did. Is this- wait, is this gonna be like a John Leguizamo story where you, like, you- where you were playing- You were- no, I'm sorry. You were cleaning it, and then it went off, and you thought you broke it? No. Because that's his story. The fuck? No, no, no. I- I basically... What happened was, my dick kept getting boners. As most guys' dicks do when they hit puberty. Wait, how old? 12. Oh, okay. And what happened was, like, it was fine, but not during school hours. And I was wearing pants, and I didn't really know how to adjust it. So it it ended up hurting me quite, quite a bit sometimes. So after, like, a while, maybe a, about two weeks, it, like, I, I, every day, it was like, boner, pain, boner, pain. I was like, I can't take it anymore. So, when it started hurting, I went to the bathroom, and I started fucking strangling it because I was mad, and then I discovered masturbation from that. <laughs> like, GET THE FUCK OUT OF HERE, YOU FUCKING COCK! Oh shit, I broke my watch. With <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the anger was so much that I- If only you had the watch that I had in fucking middle school. <laughs> Jesus Christ, hang on. Let me see if I can reenact what you did, basically. How the hell did this watch even just- no, Are you okay? That's my clan. Oh, there we go. But my watch? No. Yeah, the watch is fine. That's okay. my clan. That was actually a new. Yeah. Uh, that's a new thing that my watch did that. But all right. So it's like, fuck you. You're gonna stay soft, uh, motherfucker. Uh, strangle. Uh. Oh well. The fuck did you just drop? Not the watch again. Wow. Yeah. You know what? I gotta get a new watch. This watch sucks. Right but yeah, I discovered masturbation by trying to strangle my dick. Yeah, that's usually how people do it. Never... But then for a while I was doing it wrong, so like, I lost some skin on the head of my dick. Wait, what do you mean you are doing it wrong? I lost some skin on the head of my dick because I was doing it wrong. Wait, how are you doing it wrong? I'm just curious. Okay, alright, alright. So, here. Like, doing it- oh, okay. I so like, demonstrate it. So like, th this is the dick. And keep in mind, I'm 12, even a lot of people do it wrong at first. So like this is the dick, and then I would I, I would take my hand right here, and I would just I would just go like go like like that with it. Oh, you would chafe it. Yeah. So my dick would end up bleeding. Sometimes very minorly. Damn, dude. Very minorly. So now the head of my dick is just not smooth anymore. What the fuck? So I need to see a dermatologist about that. Yeah, um, I think it's just you put some lotion on your dick. No, you, I, well, what, like, like, do you want to see it? Like, I don't want to. What can do to, what can be done to replace or fix 
damage slash missing missing skin. Well, you can't really replace like skin graphing. That's the only thing that replaces missing well, skin. But because it's really... like little like all right, little parts of it are just gone. Like not like oh, fucking fifty percent of the dick is gone. No, just little bits, and it's like layered out, so it's like cracks, kind of. Wait, where we were here before? Alright, now we're just going back. And it's circles. like at the base of the head, like the tipping area is fine. So, what the fuck would I? A skin graft wouldn't be for my dick, would it? Need it for that? I would. I would talk to a dermatologist about this. But in all honesty, dude, I would just do some vitamin E hand lotion to like repair some damaged skin or something. I mean, she probably he or she, he or she that's looking at your dick would probably tell you the same thing. Because I feel like it's either a skin graft issue or a wait a minute. Health I, cells wait, rebuilt. I, I, I gotta. I gotta ask a question. Have you tried looking this uh, qu a question on online? Yeah, and there's not much info. Yeah, I think, I think that's like a tender topic, but... Next time you go to your doctor, be like, uh, my dick is... I don't up. really have a regular doctor. Does it... Okay, you get a regular doctor and they refer you to other doctors, right? Is that how it works? Most likely. Because I haven't been to a doctor in a fucking long time. I mean, they probably would... Uh, suggest a dermatologist or something like that, but all I'm all I'm all I'm thinking about is a scenario that will that'll play out is um. It's like what happened? No, 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 no. This is this is the, the scenario that's gonna be playing out in my head. You're gonna be talking to your doctor, being like, doctor. No, you know what? Just 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 tell t like I'm your doctor and just tell him the whole entire thing. Okay. Well, you know the story. No, no, just just I'm your doctor and just tell me like if I was your doctor, I was like, oh, what seems to be the problem? Well, I'm missing some skin on the head of my dick. Wait, that's actually you're gonna you're gonna play it out. You're gonna tell the doctor just like, just yeah. like that. Yeah. You're not gonna explain like more details. I mean, if they ask for details, which I'm sure they will. Yes. I'll no, be no, like no, when you I was what? younger. When I was younger, I masturbated in a very very incorrect manner. No, like you'll you'll start off like doctor. Um, I masturbated when I was younger. I just yeah, do it from right there. Like I masturbated in an incorrect manner. So and so and so. Just just do it. And from now there. there's some there's some uh, there's some skin missing off my dick. And this is what's playing out of my head. Uh, Joe, I'm a pediatrician. Didn't you notice you're sitting on a fire truck? <laughs> but, um... That's what's playing out of my way, head right now. The way I see it, either one of two options. Skin graft, or, or, whatever type of creams, lotions, whatever, they use to, like, put, when you rub on something, it fills in the gaps and helps cells grow and regenerate there? It doesn't there. exactly really exist. I mean... I mean, you know what I mean, right? Kind of, but that doesn't really Same way how, like, you use there's, a special oil to... There's a vitamin E patch that just... It helps with scars. It doesn't really, like, regenerate skin. I mean, there's nothing that actually would regenerate skin. You're not Wolverine. I mean, not that I'm aware of. I mean, you can... Like I said, I would ask the doctor... I mean, it's not... The dick is fine and functioning, and it doesn't physically bother me. I fuck with it. Obviously, this happened when I was 12. Like, it's like, I fucked many girls and they haven't complained at all. As a matter of fact, they find it quite pleasurable. Yeah, it creates a grinding sensation. <laughs> Does it really? That's what I've, I've been told. It's like, ooh, that feels kinda, kinda nice. It's like, it's like, it's like, Oh uh, shit, dude, I can't find this bomb. Oh, there, yeah, it, is. there it is. Jesus Christ, it's a little I'm not sure how to describe it. It's like, 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 it's fuck. like, it's like the natural grooves on your dick, but at the head. Basically. I'm sorry, but the way how you're describing it, it sounds like a like a, a sandpaper dildo. That just sounds painful. Exactly. You know what? Next time on the cooperators, we're gonna talk more about the sandpaper dildo. So can you hang on to this? Yeah, we'll, we'll see you we'll, next we'll, time. We'll talk about my dick. Had the Joker got away.